Only one person has ever won both a Nobel Prize and an Ig Nobel Prize, and that's Russian-born Dutch-British physicist Sir Andre Geim. First he got the Ig Nobel in the year 2000 for levitating a frog with magnets. It turns out that water itself is just a little bit magnetic, like billions of times less magnetic than iron. And apparently, if you turn your electromagnet all the way up and throw a frog in there, you can electromagnetically levitate it. And it doesn't even actually hurt the frog either. Like if you had an absolutely gigantic electromagnet, he said you could technically levitate a person without any problems. The experiment was part of what his lab calls Friday Night Experiments, where they work on crazy things that probably won't work out, but if they do, it'd be really surprising. They take up about 10% of his time at the lab, and are generally done in areas where he doesn't have any expertise. Interestingly, the Nobel Prize that him and his colleague Konstantin Novoselov won in 2010 was also born of these Friday Night Experiments. They rediscovered, isolated, and investigated the wonder material, graphene. Graphene is the thinnest material in the world. It's a one atom thick hexagonal lattice of carbon atoms. But it's super strong, proportionally 200 times stronger than steel, and it's really super conductive too. So it has buttloads of potential applications in things like semiconductors and batteries. What they did is they took graphite from pencil lead and put it on scotch tape. And then they folded the tape and pulled it apart over and over again until it was one atom thick and they had graphene. On winning both prizes, he said, frankly, I value my Nobel Prize and my Ig Nobel Prize on the same level. For me, the Ig Nobel Prize was the manifestation that I can take jokes. A little bit of self-deprecation always helps.